Definitely recommend. Taste delicious. Okay, well, whatever. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be bringing you guys a current favorites video for the month of July. So as I'm filming this, it's July 30th. There is a bunch of different things in here. There's food, there's books, there's TV shows I like watching, there's just some miscellaneous things. Okay, so I'm going to get started. I have a list on my phone right here. So the first thing are these reusable straws from Target. You can barely see it because it's like clear. But the pack I got comes with three, three gray, three blue, and three white. And I will put the brand name on the screen because I can't really remember what it was. But I got them from Target and they were $6 for six straws, which I think is a pretty good price. And these are really nice because they're silicone. So like when you chew on them and stuff, like it's not like metal. Because I used to have metal straws and like you cannot chew on those. Like you would hurt your teeth. So then I had to switch back to using plastic straws, which is really bad for the environment. Then one day at Target, I saw these and picked them up. The one thing they aren't good for are stirring. Like when I stir my iced coffee in the morning, they're not very good for that. They're kind of flimsy, but besides that, I love them. I just got all this dirt on my straw and now I have to wash it. Okay, well, whatever. Four Days of You and Me. This is a book by Miranda Kenialli. I'm not quite sure. I never heard of her before. She's actually from Tennessee, which is... Um, where my cousins live, so I thought that was cool. It's based in Nashville, and it's a love story between the main character, Lulu Wells, and, um, Alex, I don't know how to pronounce his last name. So every year on May 7th, their school goes on this big field trip. Before the field trip, Lulu hates Alex, and she likes someone else, actually, and then on the first field trip in freshman year, her feelings start to kind of change, and throughout high school, it just shows the relationship. And at the end, there is a little bit of like a teeny plot twist, kind of. I really like the characters in this book. Lulu has a best friend named Max and a cousin named Grace. And the author does a really good job of developing them as well as the main character, Lulu. I picked this up if you like romance or like lighter books. I read this on the beach and it was perfect. 337 pages, so... Not too, too long, just kind of average. Kind bars, these kind bars are so good. When I was on vacation in Tahoe, I started getting these because, I don't know, for a while I just didn't eat kind bars. But peanut butter dark chocolate, which is so good. It has eight grams of protein. The ingredients aren't too, too bad. But these are pretty like decent in ingredients considering the amount of protein. I really like these and the taste is just amazing. Waterproof mascara, this is the Monsieur. I'm not in French, I'm in Spanish, so don't at me. Monsieur Big Waterproof Lancome Mascara. If you guys want to go buy it, you definitely should. It's like $24 or $25. It's really great. I used this at the lake and then at the pool. I feel like I had, did a pretty good job of like separating my lashes and also giving them lots of volume because I noticed things that give you lots of volume also just make your lashes like clump up and it's so annoying. There's a non-waterproof version as well, but if you're going to like the pool or the lake or something, would definitely recommend. So I just picked up these like sapphire um, shorts. They're actually called the Larkspur Hottie Hot Shorts from Lululemon and they're so, so cute. I love the little mesh detailing. And then there's also like that little panel um, that's like re reflective if you're running like in the morning or at night or something. Logo, zipper pocket on this side, and then inside here there's a little pouch. Hue, who, I don't know, chocolate bar. And I got mine from Whole Foods. It is so, so amazing. I have been waiting to eat this um, just so I could show you like the packaging and stuff. Almond butter and puffed quinoa dark chocolate. It's made with organic cocoa and it's vegan. And there's no palm oil, no refined sugar, no cane sugar, no sugar alcohols, which is like really bad for you. And it tastes delicious. So next, I'm going to talk about my favorite new TV show, Gilmore Girls. So I started Gilmore Girls, I think, June. And now I'm on season four, episode 20. Me and my family, maybe it sounds weird to you, but we watch it together. It takes place in a small town called Stars Hollow. It's basically the relationship between Rory and her mom, Lorelai. So basically, Lorelai had Rory when she was 16, and she named her after her. Basically, when the show starts, Rory is 16, Lorelai is 32, and it kind of just goes through their life. And it's a lot about relationships, and it's very character-driven. It's not event-driven, I would say. The dialogue is really great, really funny. But basically, in the first season, Lorelai and her mother, um, Emily, they don't have a very good relationship. 
but um, Rory, Rory, who is Lorelai's daughter again, 16, she wants to go to this really prestigious private school. Emily and Richard, Lorelai's parents, have like a lot of money, so they help Rory get into Chilton by um, paying for some of her tuition because Lorelai and Rory, like, they don't have enough money to pay for the full tuition. So here is another product I've been loving. This is the CeraVe Hydrating Sunscreen. At first, I thought it was a moisturizer sunscreen, but it is not. Do not do that. My face was so dry, but um, it's a really, really nice sunscreen. It doesn't feel like I'm wearing sunscreen on my face. It smells like sunscreen a little bit but it doesn't feel like that. It doesn't feel greasy, it doesn't feel sticky, it doesn't feel gross. I'm one of those people who like just does not like putting sunscreen on and I have like a burn like right here on my chest and like right here because I put sunscreen on but I didn't reapply it because I hate sunscreen and yeah. I'm trying to be better with my skin and use this. It's also a new product as well and I know Skincare by Hiram always recommends CeraVe. It's developed by dermatologists. Candle from Anthropology. It's this like rose gold cap and then it's like kind of iridescent pearlish glass part. But it just smells amazing. This is like the volcano scent I believe. And this is $14 for the little mini one, and then the big one I think is a little more expensive. But this is my second one. I just love burning them. I got it recently. A pink hydro flask. This is in the shade Hibiscus. Um, and I also bought this flex boot in order to stop it from getting dented because I dent every single one of my hydro flasks, the like sports lid. And also, it's like the new hydro flask that has like the thicker like rim, which I don't really know if I like, but you know pops up easily it's easy to like drink out of um like when i'm working out or whatever and the color is just so fun and summery and this would be perfect to take if i was going back to school which i'm not i'm doing online school i have not talked about that before in a video so you watching this video you're learning first actually no i told my instagram first so you guys should go follow my instagram to learn about things before my channel because i show behind the scenes of me filming but yeah this is my last favorite of june or July. So thank you guys so much for watching the video and I will see you all next time. Bye!